this week as federal regulators were again under fire for failing to protect this nation's food supply. Legislation has been introduced to make the public aware of a common industry practice that makes meat look fresher than it may actually be. Red fresh meat, or is it? Congressional hearings pointed to the pitfalls of treating meat with carbon monoxide. Treating meat with carbon monoxide allows the meat to keep its freshly ground red color, even though the meat may have spoiled. I have a picture on the screen, there's two packages of ground meat that were left out at room temperature for 27 hours. You can see the one which was treated with carbon monoxide looks fresh and red, while the other meat has turned brown and quite nasty looking. Congressman Stupak and Congressman Ed Markey have introduced legislation that would require meat treated with carbon monoxide to be labeled so the consumer would know. According to the industry, two-thirds of all meat and chicken is no longer cut by a butcher in front of customers or in back of the supermarket case. Now, pre-packaged, case-ready meat is prepared off-site at large distributors and then shipped to supermarkets. The carbon monoxide treatment keeps meat looking fresh in process. Food experts say a pound of ground beef cut by a butcher goes brown in four to five days. But meat treated with carbon monoxide by a meat packer can stay looking fresh for weeks. It's the same with imported seafood. Congressman Stupak says his subcommittee tested seafood from China and Vietnam treated with carbon monoxide. 20% turned out to be bad and was refused. It's a problem because consumers aren't informed about how meat is treated. The meat is being treated with chemicals so that it's going to look like it's fresher than it is. I think consumers have a right to know how fresh the meat is. Industry representatives of large meat packers say the additive is harmless, and it's easy to tell when the product goes bad. The FDA has declared meat treated with carbon monoxide is safe, so the use of carbon monoxide is not banned here, but three years ago, the European Parliament's Environmental Committee outlawed it because consumers could be misled about the freshness of the meat. Communist China says it will tighten controls on antibiotics used in fish farms. China's Ministry of Agriculture said it's focusing on overuse of the drugs after traces have been found in seafood samples. Now, many of the drugs used in Chinese fish farms are banned in the United States. Just last month, the Food and Drug Administration banned five species of farmed fish from China until importers can prove that the fish are safe. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sorry.